Hi, welcome to the new video. I am Deepa Gupta from Pattern Yogi. Today we will discuss top 10 patents for which Ig Nobel Awards have been presented. The Ig Nobel Prizes are a parody of Nobel Prizes and are awarded each year for unusual achievements in scientific research. The sinker is their official mascot. The awards are sometimes a satire but are also used to make a point that even the most absurd avenues of research can yield useful results. Something like this. Does beer lead you to think that you are attractive? As it turns out, there is a direct correlation between the amount of beer you drink and how attractive you feel. This is not a joke. The researchers who conducted this study were awarded Ig Nobel Award in 2013. These awards are often given by actual Nobel laureates at a ceremony held at Harvard University. This ceremony is itself very funny. So please do check out the videos of past ceremonies available on their website. At the end of this video, we will also show some snapshots of the past ceremonies. So here are top 10 patents for which Ig Nobel has been awarded. Award in the category Visionary Technology was awarded to Jay Shipman of Michigan in 1993 for inventing AutoVision, which is basically an image projection device that makes it possible to drive a car and watch television at the same time. You know, it is always nice to get some entertainment while driving, like bungee jumping with the car over the cliff. The prize was also awarded to the Michigan State Legislature for making AutoVision legal. You know, you can always count on your politicians to do the right thing. Manage Healthcare Prize was awarded posthumously to George and Charlotte Blonsky in 1999 for conceiving an apparatus for facilitating birth of a child by using centrifugal force. When a woman is ready to deliver her child, she lies on her back on a circular table. She is strapped down. The table is then rotated at high speed. The baby then comes flying out into the net. George Blonsky was a mining engineer, so that explains a lot here. Right? I mean, he thought that mining coal had some relation to mining babies. Not surprisingly, no one ever used the device. In 1999, Ig Nobel in the Peace category was awarded to Charles Fury and Michelle Wong of South Africa for inventing an automobile burglar alarm consisting of a detection circuit to detect a burglar and then activating a flamethrower to burn the burglar. I mean, this is something that ISIS could use. In fact, they've already used it. Despite the warning, don't reinvent the wheel, people even now continue to do so. In 2001, John Keek from Australia filed a patent for a wheel and the Australian Patent Office surprisingly granted the innovation patent to him. So the Nobel was awarded jointly to John and to the Australian Patent Office in 2001. Frankly, I think the Patent Office deserved it much more than John. And John just got lucky here. John was a freelance patent lawyer and he wanted to prove that the innovation patent system in Australia was flawed because submissions did not need to be examined by the patent office. The office was apparently rubber stamping all the patent applications filed and boy did he prove his point. The patent was later revoked after much public humiliation. But we at Patent Yogi laud patent office's efforts to recognize the greatest invention ever by granting a patent for the wheel. Not awarding Ig Nobel for wheel is like not giving Nobel Peace Prize to Gandhi. Who does that? In 2004, the engineering prize was given to Donald J. Smith and his late father Frank J. Smith of USA for patenting a method of concealing partial baldness. 
the hair styling requires dividing a person's hair into three sections and carefully folding one section over another. Aha! This is probably one of the most widely used inventions. Almost every bald person is infringing on this pattern. It is often used in Hollywood movies. Even the US presidential candidate Donald Trump uses this technique to cover his head. In 2005, medicine prize was given to Greg A. Miller of USA for inventing nuticles. They are artificial replacement testicles for dogs. They are available in the market in three sizes and three degrees of firmness. You know, firmness matters a lot when it comes to balls. The implantation method involves incising the tunica vaginalis containing a testis severing the spermatic cord, removing the testes through the passageway and inserting a prosthetic device through the passageway and into the lumen of the tunica and closing the tunica. The second testis is similarly replaced. Miller believes that dogs psychologically and emotionally need their balls, whether or not the sex organ produces any testosterone. This sounds funny, but it is a serious invention which is widely used. Kim Kardashian's dog Rocky Kardashian has nutical implants. That is not surprising given that Kardashians love implants. Miller has sold over 150,000 of his nuticles. Miller also published a book Going Going Nuts, chronicling his journey that led to this invention. The book is said to be quite funny, so do check it out. The economics prize in 2007 was given to Ko Sheng Shai from Taiwan for patenting a device that catches bank robbers by dropping a net over them. Humans have been using net to catch fish for a long time and who would have thought that humans could capture other humans using these nets? How ingenious! The chemistry prize was awarded to a group of Japanese researchers in 2009. They invented and patented a wasabi alarm that sprays airborne wasabi to awaken sleeping people in case of a fire or other emergency. We at Patent Yogi think this is a really useful invention. Spraying water could unnecessarily spoil a lot of furniture in small fires. Any chemical spray will be hazardous, but wasabi is organic, so this is green invention. Look how green it is, and moreover, it is foolproof. Who can tolerate the smell of wasabi? In 2009, a Global in Public Health category was awarded to Alina, Rafael and Sandra of USA for inventing a bra that could be converted in one or more face masks when required. In an emergency, the bra can be quickly converted into a pair of face masks. Oh no! <clears throat> one for the wearer and one to be given to someone needy nearby. I am sorry, but to me, they sound like some weird male fantasy. In 2013, the Safety Engineering Prize was awarded to Gustano Pizzo of US for inventing an electromechanical system to trap airline hijackers.
the system drops a hijacker through trap doors, seals him into a package, then drops the encapsulated hijacker through the airplane's specially installed bond bay doors. The hijacker then parachutes to the earth, where police, having been alerted by radio, await his arrival. It would be so cool to parachute hijackers while flying over oceans, right? Thanks for watching the video. We will like to get some feedback from you. Do you like list videos like this one where we talk about a bunch of patents in a single video or more elaborate videos on a single patent? Please let us know in the comments below. Until next time, keep innovating and keep patenting. Here are some snapshots from the past ceremonies. Enjoy!